been 97 years since a nuclear apocalypse killed everyone on Earth. Fortunately, there were survivors. Hi everyone, I'm Jairo Castillo and I'm here to share my thoughts on the TV series The Hundred. For those unfamiliar, The Hundred is a apocalyptic science fiction drama that originally aired from 2014 to 2020. It was based on the book series of the same name by Cass Morgan. Having heard great things about The Hundred, I came into this series with high expectations. I was particularly intrigued by the premise of a group of young delinquents being sent to Earth to determine if it's habitable after a nuclear disaster. I expected a thrilling and suspenseful storyline with complex characters facing difficult moral choices. The Hundred takes place in a future where a devastating nuclear apocalypse has left Earth uninhabitable. The survivors, who were living on a space station called the Ark, sent 100 juvenile prisoners to Earth to test its viability for recognition. Once on the ground, they discovered that Earth is far from empty, encountering other groups of survivors and facing numerous challenges. The series followed their struggle to survive, navigate politics, and confront moral dilemmas in this hostile new war. The Hundred boasts a talented cast that brings depth and authenticity to their characters. Elisa Taylor as Clark Griffin, the best, my friend, I love her, and Bob Marley as Bellamy Play anchored the show with their compelling performance. The assembled cast, including Mari Agrepolos, Lindsay Morgan, and Richard Harmon, among others also shines in their respective roles, making the characters feel believable and relatable. The series showcases some visually stunning sequences, especially when it comes to depicting the post-apocalyptic Earth and its various landscapes. The cinematography captures the beauty and danger of the world these characters inhabit. The special effects used to portray the futuristic technology and the overall atmosphere of the show are also praiseworthy. The Hundred explores a wide range of themes, including survival, leadership, morality, and the consequences of our actions. It delves into the complexities of human natures and the choice we make in extreme situations, and the length people will go to protect their loved ones. The Hundred is an enthralling and addictive TV series that kept me hooked from start to finish. The well-developed characters, intense plot twists, while some seasons are stronger than others. The overarching story remains compelling throughout. As a viewer, I thoroughly enjoyed the series and found it to be a worthy addition to the post-apocalyptic genre. If you're a fan of post-apocalyptic dramas with complex characters and morally ambiguous situations, I highly recommend giving The Hundred a watch. It offers a blend of actions drama and thought-provoking storytelling that will keep you invested. However, we prepare for some dark and gritty moments as the series doesn't shy away from exploring the harsh realities of survival. In conclusion, The Hundred is a gripping TV series that offers an intriguing premise, talented cast, and a thought-provoking exploration of human nature. It strikes a balance between intense actions and compelling character development. If you decide to embark on this journey, I encourage you to share your own thoughts and opinions on the 100 in the comment section below. Happy watching!